And what is up, YouTube? It is Superman Abel. Um, coming with a review, finally. Um, I've been organizing some of my figures, and I do got reviews coming, so please bear with me. I should have some later today, or I'll probably make them right after I do this one. Um, whether I have enough time to upload them today or tomorrow morning is the true question, but we'll see what I can do. <clears throat> so, please stay tuned. Um, I was actually able to find this one at Target. It is the Pokemon Snorlax uh, with the soft belly. So, it's kind of squishy, but there's still like hardness to it behind it, so... And it comes with that, uh, was it the Z crystal, I believe? I don't know anything. I'm not too familiar with these crystals. <clears throat> I seen the watch and it had other ones. But this is funny and crazy how this figure actually has 11 points of articulation. So, um, from this Caesars, that watch I was telling you about, I seen this set. I uh, probably will get it later on. This one I probably won't. That one I have. That one's not bad. The Machop and the Growlithe. <clears throat> probably get those two later on. If I do, I do. If I don't, I don't. It's not that big of a deal. Um, I did see extras of this one. And I didn't pick it up. So I will review this one also as well. And this Ash comes with uh, 17 points of articulation. And Pikachu is just basically... And one regular pose, <clears throat> the way he was molded in, so that's fine, you know. I don't, you know, I don't need to articulate a Pikachu. I think there is one, if I'm not mistaken. It's by uh, SH Fake Quartz, I think. There's a Pikachu, and I also think there's a Mario. Uh, maybe one day I'll get them. Um, I would like to do a review on those two. Um... Been thinking about getting into other stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna get into SH Figwarts or Mafex. Um, I see other people with uh, figurines <clears throat> or what have you. Uh, and they look pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Um, I see people with the SH Figwarts wrestlers like The Rock or Stone Cold and stuff like that. And they look pretty good, I'm not gonna lie, like I said. But we'll see what happens. Um, Take one day at a time, right? So, without further ado, uh, who should do first? Uh, we'll do Snorlax. So, basically, packaging is basically, like, all taped up on the side. So, what I'm going to do is just go in at an angle and then slice downwards. Did it? No, did not. <clears throat> you know what? I'll just slice the rear. John, I gotta be careful with this knife. No matter how many times I repeat myself. Like, I literally gotta... <coughs> Sorry guys, coming out with a cold And I gotta work with these twisty ties Give me a second And so, what is everybody going after? What is everybody hunting for? What is everybody searching for? Or what kind of trades are you looking for? Let me know <clears throat> in the comments below. Um, is everybody 
caught up on DC? Is everybody caught up on Marvel? Or, you know, what's, what is the word, I guess? And what are you waiting for? Are you guys waiting for the um, Black Panther wave? I'm not, it's not really catching my eye. Uh, maybe the Black Bolt. <clears throat> Since I believe it's probably its third version of the Black Bolt figure. But other than that, maybe the two Black Panthers and that's about it. <clears throat> All right, so sit them down right there. So we have this pamphlet, booklet, checklist, <clears throat> whatever you want to call it. And it's a pretty long one. Um, I did not know they made a ditto. I would like to get that ditto. Um, maybe that Abra. And I think that's the first. <clears throat> they made it, they changed it up, I think, right? I think that's like the first. Um, uh, version evolution of uh, Snorlax and then you get this big guy but that was later on I'm, I'm not sure if that's confirmed if you guys know let me know but this is a huge checklist <coughs> all the EV evolutions that's pretty dope those wolves look pretty cool Reminds me like of uh, Digimon and stuff. Anybody a fan of Digimon? Digimon? Let me know in the comments below. Oh, uh, yeah, these are all looking pretty dope. I don't know why they have Ash doing that. I don't know, he's trying to do some uh, break dancing. I don't know. That Mewtwo I never got. <clears throat> I remember P2 Vision was like going crazy for that Mewtwo. But I'm glad I got Snorlax. Uh, I guess I will try to hunt down that Mewtwo. He, I seen it maybe once. I didn't like the paint app on his face. And I think his eyeballs were messed up. In the back, yeah, you get a cool little poster. This one's a lot better than the checklist on the other side. <clears throat> like I said, I want that Abra. That Cubone, the Growlithe. Uh, I definitely want that Ditto. That would be nice. Uh, the three first starter ones I already have, and packaging, Eevee I have from the old ones, um, that's cool, I don't know if it's a koala with a, a big ass thing of beer, I don't know, if it is I'll get them, um, that's pretty much it guys, I don't know, there's two big ones up there, I don't know if that's the sun and the moon, I'm not too sure, <clears throat> and I don't know what the hell that is. Scyther's second, third of all evolution? I don't know. But anyways, guys, let's, let's wrap this up. This is something for the Pokemon fans and fanatics like myself. <clears throat> Alright, so basically, his feet are like on a disc. So, you gotta basically... Twist it all the way around to how you want him. Whether you want him standing, you gotta rotate his feet all the way. So you can have him like this. But even then, it's gonna be, you know, kind of like, it hinges up and down. But, you know, he's kind of top heavy. So <clears throat> maybe if you put his hands out like that, kind of get a steady pose. Cause you want to kind of have him looking like you know being him and i don't know i'm pretty sure his memory serves me correct his feet were never that close especially in the cartoons um so i would definitely say work on him and try to recreate the pose you're trying to recreate all you gotta do is just rotate it Trying to be delicate, it's a new fig, you know, just barely out of the packaging. And this disc is a little bit more.
put it outwards <clears throat> as if he's gonna be sleeping. <laughs> Catch some Z's, I guess. And it's funny. I don't know. You're going to have to have fun with this guy. It, it, you know, it is a soft belly. Kind of squishy, like a thin piece of plastic uh, that's overlapping his, uh, his core. Uh, paint app is pretty good. Not the best up top but you know it's fine the line work is decent for the most part um his teeth are believe it or not they're sculpted on so that's pretty cool i'm glad it's not like a piece of paint like a white triangle uh his arms could go out that much they can rotate 360 um it's probably would say it looks like a double elbow but it doesn't really function as a double elbow it's like more like a single um you do get head rotation 360 and it's on a ball peg so you can you could look up that well not that much see the ball is the peg i guess with that little gap, that's the highest he'll look up. And then he can't look down that much. So it's probably going to be better you hold him that high. Well, it's pretty regular. Seeing how he's always like on his back and uh, sleeping. So if you remember the game, you would find him and you'd have to play the, play the poke poker flute wake him up but then he would wake up and then he would be pissed and then you'd have to battle him and you would have to use a great ball to try to catch him what else the paint app is pretty good on here you know <clears throat> and his fingernails they're pretty good uh, I don't know if that is a stain I guess or st looks like a mark of a sticker. I'll clean that off later. But yeah, the functioning for his hands go like that. Even though it looks like, like I said, it looks like a double, but it's, I'm pretty sure it's just a single. It's pretty hidden, so that's a good thing. They can space out that much, so that's cool. We just want to have him laying all day. Laying and sleeping all day. <laughs> uh, I don't have any Marvel Legends with me <clears throat> to compare them on size, but he is a cool figure. Uh, I would recommend you guys get him. I will not snooze. Let's see what I did? I will not snooze on picking him up. So if you guys got the chance and opportunity, pick him up. Why not? If you're a fan, I'm not saying go waste your money. No, that's not me. Um, if you're a fan at, and you're a kid at heart and you, you know, have a warm spot, soft spot for Pokemon, go get them. It's, it's a Snorlax and I know they made the little one, the little toy version of them back in the day. I still have them. He's got like a hole on his back. I think you can also use them for like a pencil topper. So yeah, that's kind of like, well, it's not into scale, put it that way. So, I would recommend that you guys go pick them up. Bash is opening up a lot better compared to Snorlax. <clears throat> Chances are it's the same checklist, so we'll skip that part. <clears throat> I like this, it's cool. Pokemon. So people are like, what? Pokemon? What? What's a Pokemon? For the most part, back in the day, seeing how I'm a billion, a billion years old, uh, people would say, what is a Digimon? So yeah. Times have changed. I'm pretty sure nowadays they probably say, what is Pokemon still? And what is a Digimon? Sad, sad, sad. And here we got Pikachu. Looking nice. 
I've seen a lot of Pikachus in my life, and this is a nice one. They really painted this really nice. This is so cool. The way his tail is, just like in the cartoon, brown. Got the two stripes. Probably looking black on the camera. Sorry, guys. But you can do, you can compare. Oh, yeah, there you go. You can see how brown it is compared to his, the tips on his ears. Red dots on his cheeks. This is so Pikachu. I'm I'm pretty stoked and excited about it. <clears throat> so that's Pikachu. And we'll put Snorlax like right. I don't know how I'm going to get him. Trying to make him go to sleep for a while, but we're taking that. He looks like a big gigantic sumo wrestler. I don't know. So that's just me. <clears throat> all right, the moment we've all been waiting for, and it's Ash. About to hit everybody with. The John Cena. Okay, you can't see me. There you go. And now he's broke. Um, thoughts on Ash. Um, he's, he's okay. Um, I know maybe this is maybe from a newer line of cartoon series. I don't know. Let me know in the comments below. Um, his outfit's all right. His face scope is decent. Thank God his eyes are correct. <clears throat> the likeness of it is good. I guess, it's, you know, it's a different attire, so it's... I'll go with it, you know. I don't know what kind of kicks these are, but, you know, hey. As a shoe head, if it works for you, go for it. I mean, he's got his watch. Pretty cool, pretty cool. Mm, what else? <clears throat> well, let's get into it. So, bends at the knee. Hard to tell. It looks like a double, but no, it's a single. Some of these joints are like small and they're like weird looking, so it bear with me. That's a single jo a single joint at elbow, for sure. I don't know why it keeps popping out. It's like super, super loose. <clears throat> uh, there is no waist swivel, unfortunately. There is no thigh cut. Uh, he does swivel at the ankle. Uh, bends down a little bit, but I feel like I'm putting pressure on it too much. Ooh. Sorry, guys. So yeah, it looks like he's putting pressure. It looks like I'm putting pressure on it and it's messing it up. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, he does got the butterfly effect right there. Goes in, goes out, goes in, goes out. Um, he does rotate. Pull 360. He arms can go up that high. They can actually go back a decent amount. With that butterfly effect, because <clears throat> it's really like on a ball peg. Um, his foot could go out that much. Can't go back that much. Um, that much, which is okay, I guess. Um, but that sucks. No waist swivel. Uh, his head could go full three sixty. It could look up that much. Without me applying more pressure to pop off the head. And he could look down. Not that much. He looks like it's a neutral pose. With his head uh, pointing downwards. I think there's a ball peg in there. <clears throat> I'm not going to find out the hard way. 
but I don't know what's up with this arm. It keeps coming out. Maybe it's warped. It looks like it's, yeah, warped a little bit. I gotta fix that. Um, the hands. They're on the hinge. They could go up. They could go back that much. And you do get a swivel. So, yeah. Elbows are single, like I said. The knees are single. It just looks a little bit confusing with that piece right there, but no, it's, I gotta look at that and realize, nah, it's not a double, it's single. You know, uh, there is more, but not that much more articulation on this Ash compared to uh, Snorlax. Snorlax, keep in mind, like I said earlier in the video, he only has um, 11 points of articulation, where this Ash has 17, so, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Six more points of articulation Ash has. So that's kind of good. You know, but you really can't do the splits. But, you know, you don't want to be putting Ash in the splits. He's, he's too cool for that stuff. So, I think um, if you're a fan and fanatic and you don't have an Ash in your collection i would say uh get them and if you don't like pokemon if you don't like uh superman able then i think ash has two words for you yeah so overall i think they're worth it to be honest uh they're cool figures Especially if you are uh, you grew up watching them and stuff like that. I would like to get the original costume. See, I mean, that sucks. There's no, like, no waist swivel. And I could use that right about now to get this guy in some poses. But I think for the most part, he's just going to be like in a running pose. I don't know. Him and Pikachu are running. Tune in next time. For the Flash. See, that elbow keeps popping out, man. I don't know. I got to get a knife and cut it up or something because it's, it's ridiculous. Probably because it's been in the packaging. Probably it's a brand new fig. Watch is pretty good. See, I guess he's got that Z crystal on there. Or two of them, if I'm not mistaken. But that is my overall thought and opinion. On these guys, um, I was gonna put them on the stomach, but <laughs> look like make it look like they're both taking a nap. Like I said, guys, if you're a fan and you enjoyed the cartoon as much as I did, um, I guess growing up we didn't have that much stuff, or there were so many things to get into. Then I would say get them. Uh, why not? You know. If you have other Pokemons, then, you know, it'll be a great fig for the collection. There's a size comparison real quick. If I can get them to stand. So, overall, it's not bad. Um, I think I can make Snorlax a little bit taller if I put the two feet closer together. But he's going to look, he's look, he's gonna look kind of weird. You know, nobody has their feet together that much. And, or that close. So, that'll be on the weird part. Even Pikachu looks good. So, that pretty much sums it up, guys. Um, sorry for the tripod falling twice. Um, and there goes Ash. Uh, one more thing I do want to show is the Z crystal. I guess you put this on the thing and it gives you light effects. See, there's like, it's clear. It looks like a light bulb in there. I'm not sure. I guess it turns on with these three little uh, magnetic circles, I guess. They probably lock in. 
something goes probably in there to hit that one and which turns it on gives it light effects i don't know about the watch if you guys know about it let me know in the comments below but if you do guys see these things pick them up um maybe not right now or maybe we'll see i might go pick up doubles keep mint on card uh because if you guys don't know a lot of the digimon stuff uh is worth a lot of money these days and so yeah i still got a lot of my digimon stuff but they're open i didn't keep any mint on card uh so yeah guys that pretty much concludes this keep in mind there will not be that much uh articulation think of uh marvel legends toy biz uh series one and two from back in the day you know not that much articulation uh what you get is what you get and um that pretty much sums it up guys hope you guys like the review i do got more i get back to the swing of things tomorrow or later today after this video with uh marvel legends i will be doing an unboxing of uh a carnage and another mint on card figure as well to do a comparison so give this video a thumbs up a like if you're new subscribe everybody that is subscribed thank you for your uh loyalty thank you for still staying with the channel and that pretty much sums it up it's a long ass video so apologize and know some people don't like long videos some do but pick them up guys if you're a fan keep repeating myself um not, not i mean they're more of a display piece if anything and that's cool enough to be honest you know you can't be a hypocrite and say you know oh i don't you know i wouldn't get it just to display it but yet you buy legends and multiverse and multiverse is kind of crappy but you know you get it for the bad piece or a figure you like so this is a non-judge free zone ain't nobody judging you but just don't be a hypocrite so pick them up if you want if you're a fan it is fun uh collect stuff from your childhood maybe at the time you didn't have money maybe at the time your parents didn't have that much money and toys will always be expensive they're just getting more expensive so think of it as a blast from the past and recreate your, you know, your Pokemon scene if you're a Pokemon master like myself. And I am a master. If you don't believe me, next video I will show you. I have completed my Pokedex of 150 on my Game Boy Blue and Red. Yellow, I'm almost there. But I'll show that in the next video in the opening uh, intro, I guess, scene. But... That pretty much sums it up, guys. The Superman Able. Thank you, guys. I appreciate it. Staying with me. 200 at 170, 175. We'll start talking about a giveaway. I'm still debating, thinking. I want to do something different. Not that everybody's the same thing giveaway, but you know, it's. I want to do something different. And my first giveaway was awesome, and it was different. And I want to do something different again. Um. But yeah, I'm still thinking and debating what's it going to be and how it's going to go about. So stay tuned, guys. The Superman Able, signing off. Peace. And be safe out there, guys. Later.